What is going on Outlaws and Gunners Death here with another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to get a legendary horse. It's quite simple, you want to come to Lake Isabella up north. Right in this area you're going to spot a white legendary Arabian horse. I'm going to show you the full map so you have a general idea of where we're at. Now, once you get close, you will spot him all the way out there just chilling, legendarily chilling next to two wolves. If that doesn't tell you enough about this horse, I don't know what does. Now, what you want to do is take out the two wolves because if you try to tame it next to the wolves, they will attack you. Now, as soon as you start shooting, the horse will run away. You want to make sure you stay on its tail. It won't go far, but you still want to follow him. Once you've identified which way it went, you want to get close enough, whether it's with a rope, with an arrow, or just generally on foot and calming him or her down. Once you've done this, you're going to get to the fun part, breaking down the horse. And this one is a little trickier since it's legendary, or at least I believe so, and I've tamed quite a few horses. Now, once you got your rope on the horse, you're going to want to calm her down. This one is a female, so we're going to calm her down. You're going to want to press square, whatever button is on Xbox, and just, you know, make sure she's chilling, she's relaxed. Calm down, girl. Calm down. Easy. Now, my stamina is getting low, so you want to make sure we're going to... There we go, we can get on her. You want to make sure you can get on the horse before your stamina drains. And this is where it gets really tricky. This area is very hard. There's either wolves, blizzards, a lot of trees, or, you know, generally steep slopes. So you want to make sure you take her down as fast as possible. Use, you know, your controls to make sure you do not fall off. This is where things get hard. There we go. We tamed her, and that's all you guys got to do. It could be a little tricky if she does run away on you, which it happened to me twice you want to make sure you stay on her now that you've tamed your incredibly new legendary white arabian horse i'm going to be showing you some tips to make sure it's a lot easier to bring it back home and you don't have to deal with so much nuisance First off, we have to learn everything there is to know about this horse because it's really cool. As you can see, the handling is elite and it has incredible speed and acceleration. It's a white color as we can tell, it's really pretty and all the core stats are very, very nice. Now guys, these are some personal tips. Before you keep on going, what you want to do is brush, feed, pat your horse until you get to at least bonding level 1. This will make it so it will listen to you a lot easier if things get hairy. On top of that, there's one more tip that I want to give you and it's a little more personal. Make sure that your bonding level is level 1 and then put your saddle on the horse. Bring a weaker horse or a horse that you don't really want to keep on this mission so if anything happens to it, it doesn't really matter. With that being said, once you've reached bonding level 1, the horse will listen to you and will come to your whistles, making sure you will not lose him if he runs away if you get ambushed or some crap. Now, take the saddle off the horse you came with and go all the way back and place it on your brand new horse. And this is pretty much it guys, I really hope you've enjoyed the video, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, hit that notifications bell to stay up to date every time I post a video, follow me on Facebook, and I'll see you guys next time. For now, your boy Death Gun, out.